Hello, Cyclocross friends. It's Tuesday, October 20, 2020, and you're tuned in to the CX Hair CX Heat Check Power Rankings, where we are counting down the top 11 men and top 11 women in cyclocross this week. To do this, we use a sophisticated algorithm based on years of cyclocross data to accurately and precisely rank the top men and women currently racing cyclocross. You may not like the outcome, but the algorithm is data agnostic and the results are the results. And with that, let's get into it. Starting with the women. Coming in at number 11 is Madden Backer. A day off for Beringen before grabbing third at the EKZ race at Bern has Manin backering down the rankings from six last week to 11. In the 10th spot is Inge van der Heiden. She showed early at the front of Beringen before dropping to eighth at the finish, but that nose for the pointy end gives van der Heiden her heat check debut. In ninth is Sherman Onroy. A solid fifth place at Beringen moves to Ryder, whose last name gives most every English language commentator the pronunciation heebie jeebies when it pops up on the monitor. A bump up one spot from last week to ninth. In the eighth spot is Anik Van Alphen. After a strong start to the season, Van Alphen finishes right off the wide angle podium the last two races, which drops her a few spots from last week in the CXE check. Landing in seventh is Lucinda Brand. No racing this week as she rests her knee. Lucinda remains on brand by staying in the power rankings, but off brand by slipping five spots from last week. In six is Magali Rocket Rochette. Staying in the Swiss countryside, the specialized feedback Rafa Ryder follows up last week's win at Steinmar with a second place finish at Bern, moving Mags up from 11 to six in the power rankings. Which brings us to the heat check wide angle podium. And in fifth place is Eva Lechner. Coming off an incredible silver medal finish at MTB Worlds, Lechner lines up for her first cross race of the season and pulls off an impressive third place finish at Beringen, which shoots her straight up the power rankings on her debut. In fourth place is Anne-Marie Wurst. A seventh place finish at Beringen is not what we normally expect from Wurst, but she was going for it and at the end of the race crashed in the final corner, suffered a mechanical and had to run to the finish for that placing. And it should go without saying, Cyclocross friends, that efforts like that keep you near the top of the power rankings. And taking over in third is Yara Kastelin. Consistently in the top five, Yara finished fourth at Beringen, avoided any Yara sales, and is rewarded with third in the heat check. Which brings us to our top two. In second place is Denise Betsema. Two wins over the weekend moves her up, but too short of a time away from the sport only moves her to the second box in the power rankings. Which means that the top spot remains with Prime time! Sailing Del Carmen Alvarado earned a second place finish at Beringen to go with her first at Heaton. Those results, along with the stripes on her jersey, keep the world champ in first, but only by a thread. While you take another look at the top 11 and ponder how the application of states of dynamical systems whose apparently random states of disorder and irregularities are often governed by deterministic laws and are used in algorithms of all kinds, we will move over to the men. Starting us off in 11th place is Quentin Ehrmans, a top 10 at Beringen after DNFing Heaton, Q slips into the heat check, but has his work cut out for him to stay there. In 10th place, it's Vinny. Vincent Bastens continues his success in the EKZ with a second place at Bern and hangs on to the heat check in 10th. In 9th, it's Thomas Main, another young gun and another debut on the CX heat check. A strong seventh place in a stacked Beringen field gets Main into the power rankings. In eighth place on the CXE Check Power Rankings is Ryan Camp. Posh Sauce finished 10th at Beringen after 6th at Heaton, which drops him to 8th in the Heat Check. 7th in the rankings is Corneva Kessel. In 8th place at Beringen left Van Kessel a few parsecs short of the wide angle Heat Check podium this week. It's a measurement of distance, not time, Han. Checking into 6th place is Don Sota, Don Tana, Don Edarko. Fifth place at Beringen is good enough for Soda to move up three spots in the power rankings. And that brings us to our heat check wide angle podium. And on the fifth box is Lauren Sweck. Ginger Sauce finished sixth in Beringen, the first time off the podium this year, which drops him two spots to fifth. At fourth place, it never gets easier when you're Lars Vanderharder. It is so good to see Vander Holshot back in the mix. A strong third place finish at Beringen moves him up to fourth in the power rankings. And here we are at our final three. And in third place is Michael Van Toren out. Scary Sauce was fourth at Beringen, traveled to Bern the next day and took the W, which catapulted him up from seventh last week to the third step in this week's heat check power rankings. 
And that leaves us with just two. The same two as last week. Tone Ertz, Ellie Ezerby. While the other CX beef continued to marinate on the cobbled road surrounding Odenarda, or did it? That you, Wout? Nog even over die Wout van Aert lookalike. That... Not to be distracted by doppelgangers, the here and now CX rivalry took place in Beringen. And for this week, heat check power rankings prognosticators, it was easy sailing for the algorithm. Tone Ertz won Beringen, and Ellie Ezerbeet finished second, which means Sporty Sauce is second in the heat check. And Tone Ertz is once again on the top step. Keep your pen and paper in the desk, Tone Ertz. You've topped more Heat Check Power Rankings this year than anyone else. While you take a look at the top 11 men in the Heat Check Power Rankings, I'll close up the proceedings by once again asking you to take a second and subscribe to the Wide Angle Podium channel. Hit the thumbs up and leave a comment below. If you're feeling it, please share the Heat Check and use the hashtag, hashtag CXHeatCheck. If you want to get in touch, email us at feedback at CXHairs.com. Thanks for tuning in, cyclocross friends.